Wait, where the hell am I? Oh, right, I have to, like, no? Oh. I thought it was, like, back there. Do, 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 do. Please take me to the other right shard so I can go to Nofaka's altar. Gunbreaker. Nofaka's altar is by the Conjurer's Guild. Spent so much time doing this that I just know that off the top of my head. What's up, Elfie? My audience with the Elder Seeds here is due to commence momentarily. I'd be grateful if you could once more set see to the task for recruitment here in Gudania. After eating in the well of potential candidates has run dry, let us rendezvous with the airship ticketer counter as before. Thanks. Thanks for your help, buddy. I'm just gonna go here. One, two, three, four. Oh, there's only four here. Okay. Cannot jump over this fence. You have to go through here. No, I don't know why. God, it's gonna be truly be you? But fickle fortune must the first face I see upon my release be yours. Eh? Could it be that you don't remember me? It is I, Laurentius, the man whose crimes you exposed. I was a whaler and a regular patron at Buscarons. Oh. Laurentius! I was selling maps and supplies to the Garlians before you and those red belly poachers mopped the forest floor with my erstwhile employers. Here now. Just how many criminals have you dealt with? My ignominious fate tale ignites not the slightest flicker of recognition. What if you? Less said of my past, the better, I suppose. And what of you, adventure? What, bris bri the, the, what business brings you to this part of Gridania? Recruiting? Eh? And what is your policy on reformed conflicts? Convicts. As matters stand, the wood whalers will have not more to do with me. This, this may be just the second chance I was looking for. Revenants told you, sir? I shall leave at once. You shall not regret this, I promise you. I'm a changed man. I'm going to regret this almost immediately, aren't I? Dude tried to have me killed. Okay, but seriously, why are we recruiting Garlean traders into our grand company of all Eorzea? Like, their one job should be to stop Gridon the Garleans. What are we doing? Grandfather, you must call it a day. Let us return to the guild and rest here. Your tormented back gives up on you for good. I'm terribly sorry, we're just... No, oh, Archon, isn't it? It's been some time since our cross past cross outside of Copper Ball Mines. I... You were barely more than a novice adventurer then. Look how far you've come. Whether Meun tells me it was you who fell the fearsome Black Wolf. Now you seek stout-hearted souls to fill the ranks of a new order? Hmm. Well, your cause is undoubtedly just, and my old companion here would be much relieved to see me in good hands. Yes. Yes, I'll do it. This is the very thing I've spent my entire adventuring career working towards. I shall join your company just as soon as I've seen my Isildar safely home. Uh, Gridania's proving a lot more successful, but also I think maybe we should tell the first guy no? Seems like the not 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 the best recruit. You would offer this old man a place in your company of champions. I'm both puzzled and honored by your invitation. Pray forgive me, young master, but I cannot accept. I swore to abide here for whatever scant years remain to me, and bear responsibility for the evils my lady hath wrought upon this land.
Tis not often a guild officer such as myself gets recruited. And this company of yours certainly sounds to have some promise. Its duties appear less than focused. I must refuse your invitation until such time as the organization is more organized. So, 50-50 here, 20% in Limsa. Uh, still think recruiting the trader is probably not the best move, but, you know, what are we going to do? I don't choose who to recruit. What news, Archon? For my part, the Elder Seats here was most amenable to our requirements. A former wood whaler and a seasoned adventurer. Company will not lack for variety, that much is certain. An interesting harvest indeed. Shall we strike into Hoda while the iron is hot? Let us meet at the Royal Promenade and endeavor to conclude our remaining business. Our journey draws to a close. We are on the last city, thank freaking god. Um, no, uh, you. Yes. Send me to old off. It's not even that much slower as long as you just skip that cutscene. Left to attendant to the husting strip. Alfie's over there. Where am I going? This way. Da, the gilded city, where one's fortune defines one's worth. I hope some manner of fortune is with us, and this final leg proves as successful as the previous two. Might I suggest descending to the lower level before beginning your recruitment efforts? You do not think this Sultana will take kindly to his poaching from her personal guard. Let us meet back here at the promenade when our respective tasks are complete. Good hunting, Archon. Take me to the Ethernet shard. So one God, one, two, three, four. It's the fifth one. Ah. Now they are all over the map. a lot of running for the previous ones, but I think this is better suited for a little bit of either not hopping. Hmm? Wait, you're the man who came to Little Omega looking for that masked devil. Who knows what might have happened if you hadn't... probably be dead, and a whole lot more of my friends besides. You're such fools. Any road, that disaster really got me to thinking about our homeland and about the outsider who saved us from ourselves. I realized how easily I'd been manipulated and found to make myself a more worldly man. So here I am. New company of champions? You say it will take me to all corners of the realm? Sounds exactly like the kind of opportunity I need. Don't worry, I'm not the same stripling you met in Little Amigo. I prepared myself to e fight the evil I now know is out there. Oh, we're off to a good start. And they seem slightly better of a recruit than the ones we found in uh, Gridania. Oh, the second one was fine. First one was suspect. But what are you going to do? Oh, what a happy coincidence. 
Do you remember me, perchance? I'm Orson, of the Church of Santa Domino and Dama. Thank you again for the for your timely rescue. And I must also thank you for preventing that fraudulent priest from preying on dry bones less fortunate. The most upsetting business. Are you here with your companion? Thancred, wasn't it? Ah, uh, tis new companions you seek, then. Your proposed organization sounds a powerful force for good. But my place is the church with the children. Nevertheless, I wish you well in this undertaking. Good call, lady. Good call. Sorry, you wish to recruit me? Is this some new fashion manner of propositioning a lady? Well, I'm afraid you're wasting your time. This lady is already spoken for. Good day to you, sir. So, one successful recruit, one my place is with the church, and one who's convinced that I'm hitting on her. Okay. Uh, we had a good start, but it's kind of dwindling off, huh? I need to be surprised what rumors drift down to Pearl Lane. I know of this glorious new company of yours, and just how far I'd go to avoid getting involved with it. Ministers on the street see your organization is funded by corrupt coin, by syndicate money. If you think you're recording for recruiting for a just cause, then you're a bigger fool than I took you for. Alfie! Alfie, explain yourself. You're taking coin from the syndicate. The company looks to cure the ills of the realm entire. Listen, friend, I can scarce bear the complaints of the next stall over, let alone the conundrums of a neighboring nation. So, great start, and then absolute failure from there on out. Okay. Uh, and where are you chilling out? Royal Promenade. Okay, am I done, Alfie? Can we stop with this? Is that the last step? How oh, fared you, Archon? What hidden gems do the streets of Olda offer up to your unrelenting gaze? Single Alamegan youth. Well, you certainly give us an admiral start, even if our Yanks ranks are yet somewhat thin. These troubled years following the calamity, talk of Eorzea's salvation must seem akin to grasping at clouds. But there are those who have risen to the challenge nonetheless. And the hope that inspires these people was born in no small part from the victories you yourself have won. Thank you, Archon. And I will, will not squander the precious gift you have placed into my keeping. These recruits will become the foundation of a new beginning. Also, yes, we are free to begin. As you have no doubt surmised, the Saldana also graced my trial company with her blessings. Our first wave of recruitment is over, the documents signed, and the finances secure. There is not to prevent me from taking the next step. <laughs> You're concerned by the syndicate's involvement, as was I. Thus was the origin of every coin of their contribution carefully scrutinized and recorded. This organization will not be built on corruption. Naturally, I would prefer not to rely upon outside sources at all, but even my family's substantial coffers could not sustain a venture of this magnitude. As for the rumors and doubts surrounding this enterprise, well, such things shall plague us until the company has had a chance to prove its worth. It will not be an easy process, but we will earn people's trust one success at a time. 
Speaking of time, we should waste no more of it. Let us return to the Rising Stones and lay the first stone for a united Eorzea. Oh, is there an airship to Mordana? We're just following airships for funsies. Best part of Ulda. Tell me, General, what think you of Alfino's bold endeavor? I think it is more than bold, Your Grace. His organization would pave the way for a united Eorzea. Well do I understand his impatience, since facing the common threat of the Ultima weapon. Our nations have seemed farther apart, not closer together. Considering the many problems we face, should we not be glad that someone else is taking the initiative? We have all pledged our cooperation, yet the grumbling continues behind closed doors. Ulda is not alone in her duplicity. I myself have doubts as to the good this organization will achieve. With the inclusion of the finest soldiers of the three grand companies, it promises to be a fearsome military body. But whom will it serve? Even under the watchful gaze of the Scions, it is not unthinkable that such a force could perpetrate a great wrong. Does it not concern you that a significant proportion of its financial backing came from the coffers of the Syndicate? That those unprincipled worms might forge this extraordinary gathering of warriors into a private army? Yeah, you know, it kind of concerns me a little bit. I have trust in the Scions, Your Grace. They have spared us no end of trouble at the hands of the Primals. If they seek reinforcements, I deem it unwise to deny them. As for their finances, full many gave generously. And though our nobles proffered a sizable sum, their coin did not spill from the pockets of Lolorito and his cronies. And what of the presence of our stalwart adventurer friend in this endeavor? I doubt the warrior of light would betray our cause. Yes, there is that, I suppose. Yet I have known people to change. Whether we will or no, the events of the age hurl us this way and that, like a dust devil skipping across the sands. Cannot be done about Telechi. I have explored all avenues available to us, Your Grace. But as Uldan Law now stands, we lack the evidence to convict him of any crime. To arrest him on spurious grounds would only play into his hands. He has all but committed treason! And yet we can do nothing? In what good are governments? What worth the royal house? How deplorable this mockery of justice! Hog her, Robon. You hog her and make her feel better. This bullshit. Have faith, Your Grace. It is not over. Uh, rising stones. That is in Revenant's Toll. Now 
Okay, what do you want now, Alfie? Hmm, I, I, I wonder if being funded by the Syndicate is gonna come back to bite me in the ass later. I don't trust them. That is not a journey I soon wish to repeat. But I cannot pause to rest. The culmination of all our effort is at hand. I must see to the preparations for the inaugural ceremony. Thank you for allowing me to monopolize your services, Archon. I'm certain the antecedent will be relieved to see you free for other duties. I will also be happy to be able to do something else besides be your little errand boy. <sighs> Greetings, Archon. Alfino tells me all is in place to begin his trial company. The science shall certainly be grateful to the support of such an organization. The inaugural ceremony is set to take place here at the Rising Stones. Tottery was cooperating with Alfino to see that all is in readiness. Some afraid the recruits themselves have been left to their own devices for the time being. Quite a number of new faces have arrived in Revenant's Twelve late, and I wonder if Slothborn might find himself overwhelmed. Would you speak with him and see that if there is aught he requires? Slothborn, Slothborn, Slothborn. Let's go make friends with Slothborn. Softborn. You good? What's up, buddy? What can I do for you, Archon? You'd have your hands full helping out with this new arm of the Scions. <laughs> I barely noticed your recruits arrive. It was barely a trickle compared to the flood of treasure hunters we have passed through here every day. Well, I appreciate your offer of aid. Tis more your burden that concerns me. I told this cryo company will answer directly to the antecedent. So I trust that means less work for you in the long run. Slathborn, the shipment. We couldn't. God's woman, what befell? <laughs> We're bringing a shipment to Revenant's Toll. Permissions earmarked for the frontier effort. Just as we sought to cross over into Mordena, we were set upon by brigands. I, <laughs> I believe there may have been heretics. Many. Too many. We only escaped with our lives by abandoning the supplies. Pray forgive us. There is not to forgive. Provisions can be replaced, but small soldiers are hard to find. Take your rest and we'll have someone along to tend to those wounds. What to do? Heretics are involved, and there is like to be more than a case of simple thievery. Ishgard will need to be informed. Whence did these supplies originate? House for Tom. We collected the provisions from Dragonhead proper. <sighs> Understood. I shall see that they are apprised of this development. Archon, were you not on good terms with the Knights of House for Tom? I'll be sending them a missive immediately, of course, but I would also have you travel there and offer your considerable talents. Yes, I realize I contradict my earlier hopes to lighten your load, but I need someone who can help bring this incident to a satisfactory conclusion. Our favorable relations with Ishgard are far too important to risk cash measures. Thank you for your understanding. I'm certain Lord Horshfont will be glad of your assistance. So we are going to be heading to Carathus, which is up this way. Which is good, because I already have something else I wanted to do in Carathus that a quick pop on Ramu interfered with. 
And oh look, it's right here. From the immortal flames, I presume? Yes, I suppose you should suffice. The Holy See is not want to beseech assistance from foreign armies, but the task before us is a daunting one, and our own knights are occupied with matters of greater import. Mayhap you have already heard rumors of the Ormvale? Many a miner has been lured its, into its cavernous recesses by promises of vast fortunes to find only death, and doubly so. The noxious fumes don't get them. Cavernous fronds that lurk are happy to oblige. While there is little we can do about the former, dispatching the latter would go far in sparing the lives of unfortunate treasure seekers. So it is that we turn to you. Yeah, so that wants me to go into Orum Vale. We're going to go ahead and just... Uh, it's really sending me into fun dungeons with this. Oh well. 